Alan and I are off to Atlanta and then we are going to be in New York City. This is a birthday gift to Colin. Put our plane. Yeah. Okay, so we are at Atlanta Airport. We just ate Chick fil A. But I'm very tired, so I'm gonna try and take a nap in the airport. But we're going to board. What time is it? It's nine o'clock now. It's nine o'clock. We have to board at 10 20, so we'll see if I can sleep in this uncomfortable chair. All right, well, we made it to LaGuardia. Colin is rolling my bag. I can't even show. I don't know. I'm gonna switch probably over to my camera at some point during this vlog. I did bring it, and this time I brought my SD card. So did you bring the battery I brought my battery and my charger. So it's all gonna be good with that. We're about to get a lift, and we are going to head to the hotel, and I will see you guys there. It's so cute. You, I love it. Okay, stop. Can we talk about how cute it is? Obviously, it's New York, so the room is tiny, but my favorite thing about this place is the headboards and the lamps. I absolutely love them. Also, hello. So cute. Look at the walls. Do you love it? I do. Isn't it so cute? It's a little tinier than I was expecting. All right, well, Colin and I are going to go grab lunch because we are starving. I'm deciding if I want to change or not or if I should just stay in this. Let's just grab lunch. I'll stay in this and then when we come, we'll grab lunch, come back, and maybe get ready for Broadway. Just go ahead and get ready for that. Today's probably gonna be a slower day. We'll see. We'll see what our time's like after we get lunch. I think we're gonna go to Shake Shack, but we'll see. Okay, we got Shake Shack. I obviously got just a cheeseburger. I think Colin got the same thing. Fries, ranch, ketchup, Coke, Dr. Pepper, and a cookies and cream shake. We're starving, so we're gonna eat right now. So we are in a comic store. This is so amazing. Okay, I didn't film a lot in there because it was a little embarrassing. I didn't want anyone to hear me, but it's this place called Midtown Comics, New York City. I just got some comics as souvenirs. So I got my brother, the Thor comic. This is the mighty Thor thunder in her veins because Thor love and thunder is coming out in July, I believe. And then I got my friend James, the Spider-Man book because he is obsessed with Spider-Man. That is his all time favorite. So of course I had to get those. Okay, so I just went ahead and showered. I felt absolutely disgusting after a full day of travel. So I am going to go ahead and do my makeup for our Broadway show tonight. We are going to see Mrs. Doubtfire at seven and it is almost five. So I need to hustle to get this full glam done. I know I look like shit right now. I'm not going to in the next clip, just saying. Oh, have we? So yeah, I am going to go do that and I will be right back. Okay, so my makeup is done. I am in a major rush, so I'm going to show you my outfit really quickly. My room is a mess, so we're going to ignore that, but I am just wearing this dress from Express. I am wearing this leather blazer from Amazon, and then these tights from Amazon, and then my Doc Martens, my sparkly black ones, and then this Tory purse. I love this outfit. I think it is so cute. But we are going to be off to our Broadway show. I will check in at some point. Okay, so we finished the Broadway show. Let me tell you, I have seen eight Broadway shows. That is top three, for sure. I mean, The Waitress kind of still holds top tier number one for me, but, but we're at dinner right now. Colin has been to this place called Tony's Di Napoli, and that's what we're going to try, authentic Italian New York food. And I really hope there's cheesecake later on. We're gonna find out. We have bread. Okay, well, our food came. We got chicken parm and a vodka sauce rigatoni. Okay, the table is a huge mess, but dinner was amazing, and now we have a New York cheesecake. This is like authentic New York cheesecake. It also has an Oreo crust, which actually looks very good. I am shivering, so my hand... <laughs> My hand is shaking so bad. What can you want? Okay, I look absolutely insane right now. Also, ignore how horrible my eyebrows look. It's just been a day. I'm going off like three hours of sleep, if even that. And I've done like so many hours of travel, walking around New York City all day. Anyway, lashes are off. It's fine. 
I'm gonna go take my makeup off and then I think Colin and I are gonna turn over for the night. I'm sorry I've not been getting the best clips today. I swear they're gonna get better or at least I hope so. I feel like they've been kind of off because today's felt a little rushed but you know Friday and Saturday we have more time so we have a really jam-packed fun itinerary for tomorrow and I am so excited. So yeah, I will see you guys in the morning. So it is obviously the next morning. I just showered. I'm going to start doing my makeup now. I also have my black tea because my throat is so scratchy right now. I think it's the weather change. I don't know. And I feel so like, ugh. But I don't know. We're gonna turn the day around because I'm in New York City. I need to stop acting like a little biatch. So, <laughs> I'm gonna start doing my makeup and then when we're done with that, I will see you again. Okay, so my makeup is done. I also am ready, completely ready. I did my hair. I'm gonna show you my outfit. So I am just wearing this Rhiannon, or not Rhiannon, I am just wearing this Fleetwood Max sweater from Urban Outfitters and then this tennis schoolgirl skirt with tights and my black docks and then I have this faux collar from Amazon. It's actually really cool. And then this is from Target, I believe. I'm going like full Blair Waldorf today, but like put Serena Vanderwoodson in Blair Waldorf's clothes. But we are going to head out. I think the first thing we're going to do is go grab some bagels. So I will see you then. Whatever we do next, I will see you. Okay, so we made it to Essa Bagel. I am so excited. Look at all these bagels. And then all of the cream cheese. We got a plain bagel with plain cream cheese and an onion bagel with everything cream cheese. Well, everything herb. These look so good. That was delicious. And now we are heading over to Central Park, so we have to find the subway. So I'm gonna do that. Okay, we are at Central Park. We just took a bunch of photos. And now I think we're gonna go to the American Natural History Museum because it's right over here it's nine minutes away by walk but i will give you guys some clips of the park it is so beautiful here i love it we're on the other side of the park than i usually go to we're not by the plaza which is kind of weird oh my god i swear central park has some of the prettiest views So we have a slight change of plans because the American History Museum had way too long of a line. We are going to the Met. We also got an ice cream bar for a 10 minute walk to the Met. But yeah, I will check in when we are there. It's just as long of a line. Look at Colin holding the spot for the Met, but I really want to go to the Met, so we're gonna wait. We've both already been to the American History Museum, so we're just gonna do this one. Look at this stuff. I really hope we're allowed to take videos and photos. This is actually really cool. I need those in my house. <laughs> Tell me this is not like that Spider-Man scene in the game, the Spider-Man game when they're fighting in the museum and they just gotta dodge behind these things. That clip was for James. There are too many statues in here. Okay, look at this gate. I want that in front of my house. We're going into the medieval park. Stained glass. Okay. You see the detail in that, Colin? Look at the tiny little detail in that. Wow. This is cool. More cups. I love all the gold. I do too. And books. What is this? It's a candle holder. Yeah, 
to me. I know. I'm in Bridgerton. Look at these doors. I need those doors. One word, that's all I have for you. Bridgerton. Okay, so we just finished up the Met and now we have our street hot dogs and pretzel and we are going to eat this and then I don't know what we're gonna do next. Probably go to Saks, I don't know. We might go to the hotel so I can change my shoes. My feet hurt very, very bad, but we're gonna eat this and then I will check it out. Okay, we just came back to the hotel so that I could change my shoes. I'm back in my Air Forces. I also changed up my outfit a little bit. I'm obviously keeping the sweater, but I put on just a pair of leggings instead of the tights and skirt because that skirt kept riding up my sweater was pulling it up when we would walk around the city, so that was getting annoying. I also took that faux collar off, and I put my hair up. I was starting to feel a little, like, overstimulated and stuff, so it started getting a little bit warmer, so I needed to take off a little bit. But I'm much more comfortable now. I can definitely walk way more now. I mean, my feet still hurt, but not like they did with my docks on. So, yeah, we are going to go to Saks Fifth Avenue, I think, next, and just kind of shop around, but... I hope my pictures still come out cute. We don't even have to talk about it right now. But yeah, we're going to head out. Ten times more comfortable. Comfortable and pretty. Let's go. This is like a kid in a candy shop. I don't know if I'm allowed to film, so. Stop it right now. I am literally freaking out. The smile that was just on my face, it's just a dream. I kind of like something about that's cute. A Swarovski display. I need this stuff. Look at the statue. They have a whole jewelry floor. Stop it. Look at all the diamonds. Allie, if you're watching this, my sister, your ring is there that you would love. I love this one with the baguettes. Everything is just so sparkly. Y'all, look at this necklace. Holy shit. That is a $32,000 ring right there. But I want that necklace. I want these shoes so bad. Okay, so I just had that Baccarat 450 Rouge perfume sprayed on me in Saks. And it smells so damn good. Why does it have to be $430? Why? Now we're about to go into the St. Patrick's, I think, Cathedral. So pretty. There is the Cartier store, which I will not be entering because it's out of my tax bracket. But, you know, it's fine. We are going to enter the Nike store. <laughs> okay, we are in Rockefeller Center now, and we're about to go into F.A.O. Schwartz. That was backwards. But I love this store so much. It's like, it reminds me of when I was a kid. My lipstick looks horrible. We're just going to ignore it. And they have all these flags here at Rockefeller. Also, they changed it from ice skating to roller skating. So it's called the Flag Project. I'm pretty sure these people like drew their art or created their art, then they put it on flags. Uh, I love New York City. <gasps> oh my God, Colin! There's a giant elephant. An elephant's my favorite animal. Okay, we are at dinner at a place called Bill's Bar and Burgers, and what's so funny about it is I actually came here when I was a little girl, and I didn't realize it until we walked in, and it all just came back, like nostalgia. It was a nostalgia rush, but hopefully we get a food soon. All right, I just got a regular burger. Colin also did, but without the fried stuff on top, but he did add caramelized onions. We just got done with dinner, and I am now going to take Colin to this place called... I'm out of breath. <laughs> 
I am so out of shape. The amount of stairs I've had to walk up. It's the food that we just ate. <sighs> anyway, there's a place called Magnolia's Bakery that Colin is going to try their banana pudding because it's the best. It's the best banana pudding in the entire world. <sighs> Sorry that I was a little awkward in there. The server like walked to our table as I was filming. I was like, Aco Taco. We have made it to the best banana pudding ever. We got our pudding. We also got a mini cheesecake. So good. My makeup looks horrible right now. Ignore that. So somehow, some way, we found our way into the Disney store in New York City. <laughs> we are now in the M&M store. Sephora the night and look at the display for the new Makeup Forever HD foundation. So we just got back to the hotel. We stopped at this place called Joe's Pizza. Apparently it's like the second best in New York City. But I, by the way, I swear this whole vlog is just me eating, but it's New York City and I run out of energy from all the walking we're doing. Don't judge me. Okay. I'm extremely tired. But what I can say is that while we were in line, Colin and I even thought about like, well, okay, Colin was like, why don't we not go there? Like, line's really long. And I was like, mm, let's just go. We get in line and there's this girl, her name's Bryce. And if you come across this, <sighs> hello. <laughs> the world is so small that you probably will. Anyway, and then we were just chatting and she starts saying something about her boyfriend and she mentions that his name is Colin. So of course that starts a conversation and we're like, oh, like this, my boyfriend's name is Colin. She's like, really? So she said that her boyfriend's name was Colin and that when he got back, she was going to tell him. He got back and so the entire time we were in this line, we were just talking to them. And so we made friends in New York City. Imagine this, that we are in New York City and the two people that we meet. One of them was named Colin. Isn't that hilarious? Anyway, we made friends in New York City and we're having a blast. Also, they live on the East Coast as well. So, you know, it's just... It was just funny and it was crazy how that happened. But yeah, Bryce and Colin, ABC squared. That's what we named ourselves. <laughs> A, Bri Bryce, B, and the two Collins, C squared, ABC squared. If you come across this, hit a girl up. <laughs> we, we were joking saying we were gonna meet somewhere like in Virginia in the middle. So yeah, anyway, we're gonna eat this amazing, well, claims to be amazing pizza and then I think we are going to just lay down and chill out. So we're very tired. We very tired. Yeah. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day. What? Mm -hmm. It is the next day. It's now Saturday. I just got out of the shower. Yes, I've been wearing like the same t-shirt every day when I get ready. I swear, it's like my lucky t-shirt. Like this thing is so comfortable as well. Like it's so warm. They're starting to get holes in it. Anyway, it's my getting ready shirt. But today, I think we're gonna go like the south side of New York City. So I'm gonna go ahead and get ready and then I'll check back in. Okay, my makeup is done. I don't know why I wanted to do something purple. I was like, I'm in New York, so let's do something fun. And this is the outfit. This is a bodysuit from Express. This is the Amazon jacket. This skirt is from Nordstrom Rack. My purse is from Tory Burch. Tights from Amazon and my Air Forces. So yeah, we're gonna go get bagels, I think. I don't know, you'll find out. 
because essa bagel is delicious and I can only get it here. So yeah, we're gonna eat it as much as we can. So I will see you guys at the next So level. we just got our bagels again, but I had to get my sister a baker's dozen of bagels. I don't even know how we are going to fit these back home but I'm taxing her for sure. I'm gonna take like five out of here. So we are coming up on the 9-11 Memorial, but that is the observatory that we're going into. And here's the memorial. I get very emotional when I come over here and I had nothing to do with it. This tree survived underneath the rubble from the towers. It is still standing. I believe that's the exact spot that it was at. It's so nice here, though. This is so sad. So this was also recovered after the incident. This is so cool. Are you excited? I'm so excited. I get an elevator to ourselves and I've heard this is like the coolest part. <gasps> wow, we're moving fast, definitely. It's a twenty mile an hour. I can feel it. My ears are gonna pop. The shaky. This is so cool. It's as the years progress. Welcome to One World Observatory. Thank you for visiting One World Observatory. We are in Soho, and I kid you not, this is everywhere. You can see the One World Trade Center from here. Okay, so we went back to the hotel and I changed into warmer clothes, but we are at the plaza right now. We're about to go into the plaza, 
I think I'm gonna get a pretzel because I am starving. So we might grab a bite, something, a snack. We might grab a snack and then we're gonna go into the plaza. Well, my corn dog didn't last long. <laughs> One day, I will stay here. Absolutely. In the meanwhile, I'm eating my street cart pretzel. So we just got done. Also, my makeup looks horrible. It's been going all day. And we just got done riding these city bikes. And oh my God, you have to do it. In Central Park, it was beautiful. I saw sights of Central Park that I've never seen before. So and you absolutely have to do it. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. No. We are at a restaurant called Pazza Note, and we got some truffle fries. Oh my god. You need 4D camera to smell that. I know. Our food is here, and oh my god, it looks so good. So I got chicken parm with penne and vodka sauce, and Colin got penne with vodka sauce and chicken mixed in. Thank you, We found ourselves in a Krispy Kreme. I love donuts. <laughs> we are back at the hotel. I just wanted to show you a few things. Obviously, we got Krispy Kreme donuts. And then I got myself one of the Been There series cups or mugs from Starbucks. I also got Miss Lexi Lou one. Um, she doesn't know. That's her souvenir. If this goes up before I see you, Alexa, will. Surprise! I really wanted to get her one because, like, I didn't know what to get her at first. And then I was like, wait a minute. I could start this with her, like, how I've been collecting them. I don't think we either really drink coffee. My orange juice goes in it in the morning. By the way, I'm sorry that I didn't use my camera for any of these clips and they all look like horrible, but you know, it's fine. I didn't really want to carry my camera around. That ish is expensive. You guys also saw that we went in the Christmas store. I'm not gonna open this because it's wrapped, but I got Teresa, which is my dad's girlfriend. I got her a snow globe. We were on FaceTime last night and she was like, did you give me a snow globe? Just joking. And I was like, wait, now I have to play into it and I have to get her one. But yeah, I'm gonna take my makeup off and then I think we are going to lay down and watch some more Selling Sunset. As I'm taking out my earrings, I'm just done. <laughs> Go, thank you. But yeah, I'm gonna go take this makeup off. Nice. Did you just pull them out? That's the best feeling in the world. Spiders. Spiders. What kind of pillars? Oh, it's a giant. Arachnophobia. Trigger warning. Okay, so we just checked out of the room. We have until about four until we have to go back. So I think we're gonna go to Bryant Park first. And then there's a store in Times Square that I wanna go to that we might go to. But yeah, we'll see. We're walking to, I think, Grand Central Station right now. Shake Shack again. Just because it's what we know, and I was really hungry, so we're gonna eat this. Huh? Quick and easy. Yes. I got my little sister a Pandora charm for her charm bracelet. It's so cute. I will show you it. I don't know. Actually, I might not be able to show you it because I don't know if I'm gonna open it before I give it to her. But I'm super excited. I couldn't figure out what to get her, and then we were sitting there at Shake Shack, and I looked up, and I was just looking. I saw Pandora, and I said, I got it. I know what I'm getting here, so now I've started another expensive tradition. There are people singing worship music. 